Coming back to Matt Merrill, so that's going to stall Chad McCombie out again. They were side by side for second. Brandon McReynolds holding on to the bottom line. Oh, the problem! Is getting turned. Hal Martin goes to the inside. He'll slide back up the racetrack. Luckily, no cars down there as he came through, and the caution will come out. That was going into turn number one. That's what happens when you start bump drafting. And you start fighting for the inside of the racetrack. You see the steering wheel vibrate. I think Hal Martin has a, at least one flat tire more than likely. Did a nice job keeping that car out of the outside wall though. Third caution comes out. We know now we have 50 laps to go in this race. Everybody could certainly make it to the end from here. See if you can watch it now. Watch. Watch the yellow car. He's back behind the purple car. He runs into the back of the 16 of Joey Coulter. And when the 16 comes back to get back in line, he actually made contact again with Hal Martin and turned him sideways. And around goes Hal Martin. There's another look. Watch the Busher 55. Watch the 55 now. Busher's overheating a bit. You can see the steam yeah. coming out of the 17. They were all tight, just just trying to run it, run against each other. And that's all it took was just a little bit of a nudge from behind and around Hal Martin goes. There's another view. That's Chris Busher, the 17 right behind him. See the red car when the 16 car gets pushed and gets a little bit sideways. When he comes back down to the yellow line, he makes contact with the 55. And then I think Chris Busher made a little bit of contact with the 55 of Hal Martin from behind. It looks like Coulter had to check up maybe to catch that car, as you had mentioned. And Hal Martin, in turn, that accordion effect also trying to check up. The 17 gets into the back of him and around goes Hal. We'll ride along with him. You, you, could, you could hear the contact from behind with Chris Busher. We saw the contact with Joey Coulter from the front out our onboard camera, and you could hear the contact from behind by Chris Busher. Mm.